Uh, so here is some sample Jamovi output for a test of independence. Uh, it lists our observed counts here and then uh, expected counts underneath them. So this is not the same data. And then down here, here's our uh, chi-squared test statistic, our degrees of freedom, and then our p-value, 0.087. And that was for n equals 48 data. So that's what statistical output would look like for a test of independence. And just a word of caution about chi-squared tests here, they are widely used, but also widely abused. So you always want to verify test requirements. So especially you need uh, uh, those cell counts to be at least five. And then you want to make sure your sample is drawn from the correct population, the population that you're interested in. And if an expected count does end up being less than five, your chi-square test can give very poor results. And then statistical dependence, remember, does not imply a causal relationship. So dependence here is association, and association is not the same as causation. Correlation does not imply cause and effect.